Today's psalm is a wartime psalm that was given by the chief priests to King David before David marshals his forces onto the field of battle. And wars, back then, just like today, can be a big cause for anxiety. Imagine young soldiers hearing horror stories about their peers being slaughtered on the battlefield, so the audience is likely pretty worked up and nervous about what kind of danger they were about to venture out into. And also, keeping in mind that back then, it wasn't like they had guns where they'd shoot you in the head and you just kind of fell over and died instantly. If you were in the infantry or on the ground forces, which was most soldiers, chances are you were going to get stabbed or maimed by some sharp weapon that didn't kill you instantly, but rather inflicted lots of pain. And there also wasn't much in the way of anesthesia back then either. So hopefully that helps set the stage for what these young soldiers were thinking on the eve of going into war and also demonstrates their complete dependence on God to deliver them from their enemies. So here's Psalms chapter 20, verse 1. For the choir director, a psalm of David, may the Lord answer you in the day of trouble. May the name of the God of Jacob set you securely on high. So the psalm there is saying, Lord, deliver us in the day of trouble where we might be surrounded by our enemies and let your holy name set us securely and safely on high. Now, when someone's higher than their adversaries, they've got the advantage. God is whom endows us with the advantage and can set us in a safe place out of harm's way. So this is a good prayer for us to remember when we're faced with what might seem like insurmountable odds. May the Lord answer us in the day of trouble. May his name set us securely on high. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Take care and God bless.